Critics of Egypt's new anti-terrorism law fear it will be used to crush dissent and stifle press freedom. The addition to the law books introduced by decree by President al-Sisi is intended to counter an Islamist insurgency. Among several measures, journalists face large fines if they contradict official versions of terrorist attacks. This journalist says the criticisms are legitimate, but on the other hand, the needs of the state for such laws to combat terrorist crimes are also legitimate and it has a right to introduce them. This media analyst is more sceptical. Terrorism is defined using very wide terminology, he says, which could be used to impose restrictions on the media. The new law should have a clear definition of terrorism and not impose restrictions on freedom as is happening now. The law imposes the death penalty for anyone founding a terrorist group, creates fast-track courts to try suspected militants and protects the military and the police from legal consequences if they use force. Our Cairo correspondent says supporters consider this law to be a necessary measure specifically during this period to fight terrorist activities and to maintain the security of the country. While its critics are expressing their fear that media freedoms will be restricted and human rights compromised. Mohammed Sheikh Ibrahim, Euronews, Al-Qahira.